Sally was like four minutes on. <laughs> Good spring break. Uh, yeah, so spring break's coming around the corner. I remember spring break. Yeah, I went to uh, I went to Cape Coon with my parents. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah. Two Arab accented old people and me. Come on, <laughs> you can just imagine. My mom even entered a wet t-shirt contest. Oh. <laughs> And my dad, being the pl- politician that he is, even lobbied for uh, for some votes. <laughs> that is until he saw Christy from Berkeley High School. <laughs> that's disgusting. <laughs> how is that disgusting? Uh, tell me how that's t- disgusting. Like that, see yourself. <laughs> Let me see your troll. Oh man, the life of a comedian. Hey, which is my dollar? Saddle is you want now? <laughs> oh, oh god, god. What if it doesn't go through? <laughs> You had, you had to lubricate to please insert the dollar bill. <laughs> you can use that tonight. You can use that tonight, Sal. <laughs> My friend had to lubricate the dollar and make it fit inside, bro. You know how you don't... You know how it's tough to uh, sometimes put a dollar in a vending machine? Yeah. I'll tell you how to solve it. You lick it. You lubricate. Nice to see you. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. Let's see the list. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Pick up lines. Pick up lines. Camel. One. I see you smoke camel. And what the mess is talking. What's up with him? I was born here. How about you? Yeah. No sign with cave one. The cave? Can I, can I inspect your cave? Oh wait, wait, no, no, I had a new one. I think it came up with a new one. It's called the uh, spider hole. <laughs> you want to sleep in my spider hole? <laughs> you ever do that one where you're like, oh no, we're gonna go get supported and see, see grandma? Remember that one? Yeah. You ever gonna do that one again? That was good. I gotta, re- I gotta read it before I'm gonna train. Let's see. I gotta read right there. I gotta like go through all the things. Pick and choose. How long do you get? I don't know. You didn't tell me yet. But I know I'll um, get, get to the world. Go in first. You going first? No, he. Oh. You guys? Nervous? Oh, yeah. I haven't gone up in like what? Two and a half months? Two months? It's been a while. I didn't understand it. Like, no, they didn't. They just laughed because I said I'm killing <laughs> That's why I laughed. I didn't get it. <laughs> Everyone backstage was cracking up too. <laughs> The next guy coming to the stage, a very good friend of mine, uh, born and raised in Dearborn, Michigan. Please welcome to the stage, George Salmon. George. Please welcome George. All right, uh, first off, I don't want to say I'm from Dearborn. Here's lying from Livonia, the whitest city in the country. Anyway, the point is, I'm Arab. <laughs> Alright, uh, my name is George A. Sabo. My name is spelled Gas. Yeah, I think my parents got gas problems from the start. They came out head first in front of my way through. I'm on Stella's Harper. <laughs> my brother, his, his uh, initial spell out pass. Apparently, my family only do it. Pass gas. <laughs> you come to my house, you're not smelling the cooking. <laughs> Alright, uh, if you have any Arabs, there's a lot of things Arabs can't do. A lot of things Arabs can't do. For instance, you'll never see an Arab Santa Claus. Uh, you're going to see a guy from the wall going like this. Hey, kids. 
Come and sit on my lap. I have some gifts for you. <laughs> Candy to Dara. <laughs> Big Turkey 50 cents. <laughs> Oh yeah, you'll never see a mayor of Santa Claus. <laughs> it's really hard being an Arab, you can't get a date. You can't get a date, especially if I want to date a white girl, because you know her friends are going to be like, How's Osama doing? <laughs> <laughs> Saddam treating you well? Did Yasha bring it up yet? <laughs> but I came up with some pickup lines to you know, deal with the situation, you know? I, I felt bad with some pickup lines, like, uh, I was born here, how about you? <laughs> or, uh, if you're looking for weapons of mass destruction, well, you can stop looking, baby, because I got some right here. <laughs> <laughs> I see you smoke camel. You ever suck one? <laughs> you can do it really quick in between two lumps. <laughs> the nicotine comes right out. I threw that one in there, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, I'm an Arab Christian, which makes me about as rare as a horny panda. <laughs> what's, what's the deal with these pandas? Why aren't they mating? <laughs> I, mean, uh, I, mean, I don't like it's because they're not in their natural habitat. You know, they got them shipping, in, they're shipping them all the way out to California. I mean, it's not like you ask a French fucker to shave her pants, chop into a smoke free bedroom with a dentist. <laughs> Let me do all the work. Come on. Is that man? Prince Grace coming around the corner for those of for those of you who are U of M students. How many of you got here? Prince Grace coming around the corner. I remember spring break last year. I went to Cancun with my parents. Yeah. That was amazing. Two middle-aged Arab accented people and me walking around the beach. My mom entered a wet t-shirt contest. <laughs> yeah, my dad, my dad, he was in favor of it, being the politician that he is, started lobbying for votes. That is until he saw Christy from Berkeley. High school. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> that was no good. Actually, yeah. I never went to spring break with my parents at the game tour. <laughs> but I am a spring break, which should be interesting. All right, where are you going for spring break? Are you going anywhere? Excellent. <laughs> you didn't ruin my joke. I just, that was a win. I was hoping you would say something, but you didn't pick nothing up. <laughs> How many people work in a restaurant? Yeah, or used to? like drug addicted place you ever saw in your life? Yeah. You know? There's a mess lab in the kitchen, the bus boys doing ecstasy and the dishwasher is dropping acid. What's the deal? <laughs> yeah, I used to work at a restaurant in a steakhouse. Can you imagine me working at a steakhouse in America? Come on. I'm not in the sheet, I'm at Outback. Okay. <laughs> that one also is scratched. <laughs> Try out the new things here, people. So uh, I'm glad. I'm kind of glad I'm not gay. <laughs> uh, I, I like being straight, you know, but it's not going too well for me, as you heard earlier with my pickup lines. So uh, I think I might go to the homosexual side. But then I realized, well, what if I do that? What if I do that and I'm like, I don't get a date. I'd be like over two for sexes. <laughs> That's really all there is, you know. <laughs> and I don't want to be asexual. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go now. Party store's calling. <laughs> Keep it going for George. Keep it going for him. What was the paper shaking? What? The paper was that shaking? What paper? The paper I was holding. I don't think everybody knew who Lisa Leslie was. Really? Yeah. The tall girl, tall lady, tall girl. Yeah. Six footer. Say like six foot five. <laughs> ready? I'm ready, baby. So what do you think about uh? What if we had something really crazy like lesbians on ice? Can you imagine that? Nipples getting hard. <laughs> <laughs>